हाय वेलकम टू द ट्वेल्थ लेक्चर ऑफ द चैप्टर आयोनिक इक्विलिब्रिया टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द पॉइंट साल्ट हाइड्रोलिसिस नाउ हाइड्रोलिसिस ऑफ साल्ट इज द रिवर्स ऑफ न्यूट्रलाइजेशन रिएक्शन सो बिफोर स्टडिंग साल्ट हाइड्रोलिसिस वी शुड नो व्हाट इज न्यूट्रलाइजेशन रिएक्शन सी न्यूट्रलाइजेशन रिएक्शन इज द कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ एसिड एंड बेस टू फॉर्म साल्ट एंड अनडिसोसिएटेड वॉटर व्हाट इज द डेफिनेशन ऑफ न्यूट्रलाइजेशन रिएक्शन इट इज द कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ एसिड एंड बेस टू फॉर्म द साल्ट एंड अनडिसोसिएटेड वॉटर सो इन सच अ रिएक्शन्स एसिड एंड बेस गेट न्यूट्रलाइज्ड देयर फोर इट इज कॉल्ड एज न्यूट्रलाइजेशन रिएक्शन नाउ साल्ट हाइड्रोलिसिस इट इज द रिवर्स ऑफ न्यूट्रलाइजेशन रिएक्शन सो इफ दिस इज न्यूट्रलाइजेशन रिएक्शन देन द रिवर्स दैट इज द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ एसिड एंड बेस फ्रॉम साल्ट एंड वॉटर इज द साल्ट हाइड्रोलिसिस रिएक्शन नाउ सी सपोज फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ वी हैव साल्ट सोडियम क्लोराइड एन ए सी एल इट अंडर गो हाइड्रोलिसिस टू फॉर्म एच सी एल दैट इज हाइड्रोक्लोरिक एसिड एंड एन एओ एच दैट इज सोडियम हाइड्रोक्साइड विच इज ए बेस नाउ इट इज एन ए सी एल इज ए साल्ट सो इट हैव एन ए प्लस कैटाइन एंड सी एल माइनस एन आई एन एच टू ओ गिव दस एच प्लस एंड ओ एच माइनस सो दैट एन ए प्लस कंबाइन्स विथ ओ एच माइनस टू फॉर्म एन एओ एच वाइल that cl minus combines with h plus to form hcl so this reaction is a salt hydrolysis reaction now see the definition of salt hydrolysis the phenomenon of interaction of cations and anions of salt with h plus and oh minus ions by water yielding acidic and basic solutions is known as salt hydrolysis okay now try to understand this definition with this example in this example na plus it is a cation it react with oh minus to form naoh which is a base while cl minus which is an anion react with h plus or combines with h plus to form hcl which is acid so the phenomenon of interaction of cations and anions of salt with h plus and oh minus ions by water yielding or giving acidic and basic solutions is known as salt hydrolysis reaction okay so the salt hydrolysis and neutralization these two are the opposite reactions or the salt hydrolysis is the reverse of neutralization reaction now see to study the hydrolysis of salts it is convenient to divide the salts into four types or simply uh, the salts are divided into four types first one is the salts of strong acid and strong base for example see kcl potassium chloride sodium chloride potassium nitrate sodium nitrate etc now see suppose for example kcl it is formed from koh that is potassium hydroxide which is a strong base and hcl hydrochloric acid which is a strong acid so kcl is the salt of strong acid and strong base similarly all others are also the salts of strong acid and strong base now second type is salts of weak acid and strong base for example potassium cyanide sodium acetate sodium phosphate sodium carbonate etc now see how when we consider kcn it is made up from potassium hydroxide which is a strong base and hydrogen cyanide which is a weak acid okay so kcn is a salt of weak acid and strong base similarly see the example of sodium acetate that sodium acetate is made up from acetic acid which is a weak acid and naoh which is a strong base so it is also a salt of weak acid and strong base and it is also true for the remaining other examples 
now third type is the salts of strong acid and weak base for example ammonium chloride calcium chloride ammonium nitrate etc see for example nh4cl it is made up from hcl that is strong acid and nh4oh which is a weak base so it is a salt of strong acid and weak base fourth type is the salts of weak acid and weak base for example ammonium acetate and ammonium cyanide see in case of ammonium acetate it is made up from acetic acid which is a weak acid and ammonium hydroxide which is a weak base so ammonium acetate it is a salt of weak acid and weak base okay so in this lecture uh, we have studied what is salt hydrolysis what is neutralization reaction and what are the uh, types of salts thank you